So the date is the 29th of September 2024. Uh, just watched Man United get beat by Tottenham 3 0. And we've come for the last night uh, of the opening of the Moss Vale. I worked here for 15 years, plus a moniker, a few other people, Jason and Marie. So, what I'm going to do, I want to do a bit of a video because, you know, times and situations change with breweries. So, we're in the front of the building, come to the right hand side. And since I last worked here, houses have been built on the back end of the car park. So this steel staircase was obviously where we used to bring our equipment in with my uh, late granddad. And uh, there's not much room to be fair. So that's where we're at, at the moment. Many a time I'd walk up that staircase. A little bit more difficult now obviously as you come around to the left hand side light's not too good but obviously you've got the moss moss mossvale road no it's not it's lost that road uh, just coming up here uh, but yeah i'm gonna take you around the building give you a bit of a tour past the main entrance all the smoke because there's just on the left hand side right hand side as so we go round to uh the left hand side as you look at it from Lost Ox, Lost Ox Road. Bearing in mind, I do apologise, I have been on, on the beer for about three hours before I've done this, but I just wanted to come here for the last night. So there is where the new houses start. And these were the double gates that we used to go in there. Russ, Russ and Moni Monica will remember this. That was there entrance into the uh, living quarters I do believe well yeah well, I've actually got one memory about these bushes it was when Manchester City beat Manchester United on a Sunday and it all kicked off outside this place and the Man City fan that got up on the stools to see Munich ended up in those bushes there on so Sunday night that's a memory I'll never ever forget. So the main entrance. How are you mate? You okay? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, fine, thank you. Double doors, Sunday night, Thursday night, queuing up to get in here. Let's take you into the vault first and foremost. So this is the final night of trading for the Moss Vale. Nice to have a bit of stone roses in the background. So this is the, obviously the pool area in the vault. Not much has changed here really, but as what you go through, the only male toilet we have now is the one on our left hand side here, everybody. So obviously, you've got the die aunt in here. Yeah. <laughs> Lee, show me your trick. Oh, is it, baby? <laughs> <laughs> Show me a trick. Watch it, watch it, baby. Watch it, watch it, watch it, baby. Again. Okay, okay, watch it, watch it. <laughs> Watch it, baby, watch it, baby. Oh, that's amazing. Give me your Austin Powers best <laughs> your best impression of Austin Powers. I don't even know. I don't even know, baby. Yeah. Right, do me your best impression of Fred Elliott. I say it's about her. I say it's about her. I say, Rachel, I say, I won't go about it. 
I say Andrew and no, she's she's a lovely one. She's a Rita. Honestly, baby, honestly, baby. Hey, baby, honestly, baby. So we've walked through the front door and turned left. Now we're going to turn right, and you have. The right hand side as you walk in from the main doors so you had a um a fire escape there that you should have the uh, shutters on disabled toilet so i used to set up right over that bar straight there i uh, worked here for 15 years so a lot of different uh landlords and landladies but I probably had, it was part of my growing up working in here. So we had, no, we're not going live. No, I'm going to put it on, I'm going to put it on like a YouTube or something. So obviously raised area. This, this was probably before, uh, this came after, sorry, when I used to set up here, just behind that balustrade there. Uh, walking up the steps here which will lead you to the back entrance on the left hand side which was a fire escape just over there up them steel staircases do you know what it does actually make me feel sad 15 years and they're saying the people of Ermston and Flixen and Dave Hume we used to do a Sunday night which is fantastic we used to set up right here and it was overlooking everybody here on the right hand side. I did a Sunday and a Thursday. Sundays were probably the best, but Thursdays, as we go down here, I'll just let you know what used to happen on a Thursday with Russ and Monica. We used to, this used to, I think there used to be a set of double doors here. And that used to lead to the other side of that wall where years ago you could rent it out as a function room for private events so i'm sure if my memory serves me right that the bar used to extend and go up to that door area so continuing past this door on the right there used to be a raised area on the left hand side over here there used to be a set of double doors straight in front of you there which used to lead to the function room if you're a, a DJ doing a private event. Now, things have really changed because you used to come across this wall here on my right, you used to extend straight past that green emergency exit sign. There used to be a ladies on the right, gentlemen's on the left. But I take it that now that exit door is just to the right the steel staircase in the car park and I don't know it just makes me feel sad it's the last night that the Moss Vale's going to open for and everything, everything's going to shut no more um, yeah many a good time in here many a good time a few locals in for the last final night but this is this is, a, this is sad really, end of an era. My mum and dad actually had their wedding reception here in 1967. Into the people. Absolutely. Lovely to see you. Dave Gal, not asleep yet? I'm all right son, how are you? Men's toilets. In the best, no it's not, in the vault. So I'm gonna have to go. Take care everybody. So I'm not too sure what's going to happen with the Moss Vale, but it's an end of an era. I've been here for the final night of its trading hours, and uh, yeah, pretty sad. But I'm glad I've come in for the final night, and we don't know what the future holds for the Moss Vale. I hope they don't knock it down, but at the end of the day, if you don't support your local, your local pubs, it's going to shut down. Take care, everybody. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video.